Welcome, in front of me is a TCL406 and today I will show you how you can enable and set up your portable hotspot. Now, to get started you will need to find the hotspot which you can do by swiping down from the top of your screen. This will present you with the toggles. Now we're going to swipe down once again to extend the list of them. And on one of the pages we should have our hotspot toggle. Now there is only one page right here. And I don't see the toggle, so I'm going to click right here on this pencil. I'm going to scroll down, and you can see Hotspot is right over here. Once you see it, you can then hold it. So kind of lift it up, and then you can drag it to the top or above the hold and drag to add the tile. And once you go back, you have now added the toggle. Now, once it's added in here, if you're doing this the first time, I recommend holding it because this will quickly take us to the settings. And the reason you might want to do that is because Hotspot will come with a pre-randomly uh, generated password, which you can click right here to view. And you can see it's nothing that you'd be able to guess. Uh, so we're going to remove it. That's basically what I would recommend doing. And then we can set up the new password, which will need to have at least eight characters in length. That can be letters or numbers, doesn't really matter. And that's really the only thing that I recommend changing. What? <laughs> now, I am very confused why the hotspot is named Redmi Pad SE. <laughs> uh, for a moment, uh, I was not even sure if I'm recording the correct device. Now, the reason I'm mentioning this is because by default hotspot name will have the name of the device, which in this case should be the TCL406 and possibly like some additional uh, string of numbers uh, just as a, I don't know, whatever version of this is, what, I'm not exactly sure what it refers to, but they usually add some like string of numbers. Uh, here you can see uh, this has been changed, but you can obviously change it yourself. Now, once it's all set, you can close this and whenever you want to utilize your hotspot, find the toggle, tap on it. As you can see, it's going to show you, show you that it's turning on. And there you go, it's now enabled and you can connect to your hotspot. One more thing that I'm checking right here is the option which is turned off for some reason. I recommend turning that on. So turn off hotspot automatically. This will disable hotspot, which you can change the timer after a certain amount of time of an activity. So, for instance, half an hour seems to be a pretty good option. So, when the device detects that no other device is utilizing its hotspot for half an hour, it's going to automatically turn it off. Now, the reason you might be interested in this option is because hotspot will consume more of your phone's battery. So, if you're not using it, there's really no reason for it to be running in the background. And this will just kind of protect your battery. So, there we go. Now, once you're done with the hotspot, you can turn it off by finding the toggle and tapping on it once more manually. Uh, so obviously that will be a quicker option rather than waiting the half an hour. So with that being said, if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.